guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl jasmine Byron peace and this is my story today in this video as you all can see by the title i will be trying out this new bluetti power station y'all it's 2000 watts i'm going to be trying out i'll be camping out for the next three days so i will be testing out this power station and letting you guys know exactly how well it works and i'm gonna give you my honest opinion first i would like to give a huge thank you to bluetti for sponsoring today's video and sending over this product for me to test out for you all and i am super excited so without further ado let's just go ahead and get straight to it okay i'm gonna go ahead and unbox it i'm gonna be very honest it's heavy now so my niece is here and she's gonna actually help me well one of them is gonna help me um open it up really quick and show you all it so i'm gonna be just as surprised as y'all okay we had this together all right uh box cutter i just had it and i just put it where Ooh. all right so first opening off the box um i can see here it has uh two years of warranty here as you all can see and the warranty activation is on the back side here that's dope and then we also have what is this oh the extra power um bank for it this is what it looks like let me go ahead and open that up and it has a fan on the back of it so that's pretty cool it's, this is the power supply here it's a model t500 boom it's really nice and sleek too i like that all right so that's that and also we have a bag here on top a nice little drawstring bag and i'm guessing these are going to be some of your power cords which it is oh it also comes with a lot of different power cords okay i see what y'all got going on here so we have a lot of power supplies here. I'll list them on the screen exactly what they are down below here. All right, now for the big part. If my knees ash, y'all don't mind it, okay? All right. Oh, I like the fact it got handles on the side. Oh, child, it's gonna need handles on the side because of my back. Don't pull at your back chest. You need to pull at your knees, so squat. Yes. What a straight back. And then pull up. Girl, you're not working at time. Alright. Okay. I'm just gonna put the box out here just for a second. Alright. This is what it looks like so far, y'all. This is nice. For what I can see. Oh my god! Wireless charging? Okay, okay, let me calm down. Let me calm down. I told y'all y'all was gonna be excited just as I am. Cause I'm just as excited as y'all is, right? Right, okay. Y'all look. Come here. Hold on. Okay, y'all can't come. I gotta braid y'all. Hold on. Take the plastic off chest. Alright, so it has two, y'all, not one, but two wireless output. Now I haven't seen a power station like this before. Now this is this is top notch. Wireless quit playing with them. Quit, quit playing. The handles on them are built in, so it's not taking up any additional space at all. It's already like it basically comes in. If you, if you pick up what I'm putting down, it's it's pretty much all together, so it's still giving that sleek look. You don't have anything like popping off on the outside, which may be a problem depending on where you're trying to um, station your power station at. So yeah, oh my god, this is nice. Ah. On the side here, there are some fans on both sides, so that's good. Like spaghetti. Blue Okay, cool. All right, so let's go ahead and get into this Blue Eddy. All right, first, looking off, I just want to say that I love the fact that they have these covers on the actual power plugs. Because, one, y'all know, when you out and you camping or just natural dust from just daily household dust, it can get inside of these plugs. The fact that they have these covers on this is already, like, mind-blowing already. This is really nice. All right, so we have our power button here. Then we have our DC output. Our DC output is 12 volts. Um, then we have our another. Hold on, child. They done showed out with this. Okay, sorry, y'all. <laughs> they have another DC output, which is also 12 volts. This is for the um, car charger piece. Let's see about this one. 
Oh, the cord that they gave us, it actually would go into um, this part here. So that's perfect. Then we also have a 12 volt at the bottom. All right, 12 volt, more of the power um, cords that they um, provided us with this product here. We have a PD, which, a, which is a 60 watts boom there you go all right moving right along we have a usb which is five volts and it also oh it has two plugs here that's perfect two plugs here and then we also have another um usb it's the same exact thing let's make sure this one have two plugs so total on this we already have four u four usb plugs just total so far y'all come on over here let's go on over here so the ac output is at a hundred to 120 volts 2000 watts okay so boom we got one shall we got two hey okay, so as you all can see we have a total of six ac output outlets just right here on this on the front side y'all then don't forget we got four usb cables not only that we have two not one but two wireless charging output stations that's at 15 watts a piece so this is already dope from, from the beginning. All right, vibes. So we're just going to go ahead and power it on just to see if it have any type of power. It, it, it actually does. Y'all, this is high tech. Look at this. Do you see the screen? It's touch. Child, this is touch screen. Okay, right now we starting off straight out the box at 63%, right? 63%. Look, they have the PV for the car. Um, the adapters, um, the AC load. Oh my god, everything is on here. So this is how you turn them on and off. Um, home page. This is basically showing you all the features on your home page. Go to the settings here. Y'all, we learn it together. Okay, this is our settings. Okay, you can switch out your settings. So your AC output voltage um, is 120 volts or you can switch it to 100 volts if you like. That's up to you. Okay, and also here it has the AC output frequency. Again, and you can switch this from um, 50 hertz to 60 hertz. That's up to you. That's what you do. Um, keep going down. We have a DC input source. And this is the car. Or you can put the PV on there. So right now it's under car. So we're just going to keep it right there. Okay? Okay. And then we also have an eco mode. Which is even better. Child, they're trying to save. Okay. Save a little energy while you can. Okay. Eco mode. Yes. We're going to keep it on. Yes. Because while we're out here in the woods, child. As y'all can see, we gonna want to keep our little eco together, okay? All right. Okay, so really quick, I want to be able to test out a couple things. First thing first, y'all know what I really want to test out? It's this wireless part. So I'm going to be using Chastity's phone, and we're going to test it out. I will take your, charge, your card out of it. Okay, so really quickly, Chas is going to put her phone on here, and we're going to charge her phone and see just how well it works, okay? So Chas, you put your phone up there. Okay, and it's saying now that the DC, just got her phone on there, saying that the DC is currently off. We're going to turn it on, and then hopefully you guys can see it. I'm going to be honest, seeing the screen and the light, it's kind of hard to see. Hold on, and then hit on. Okay, now let's see if it's going to start charging her phone here. Oh, and there it goes. It's charging Chas's phone. Chas, what kind of <laughs> there and let it charge a little bit okay so now it's actually um charging chas's phone that's so dope and look just like literally a click up a button and it's charging the phone no need for the hassle of a cord or anything especially if it's a lighter device and you're not moving your vehicle or if you want to have this inside of a home it's easy to sit it on top of there let it charge and do its thing so here is showing that it is currently pulling six watts to charge chas's phone so on the display screen it's telling you exactly how much it's pulling now it says it's january January. Hold on. January 1st. J excuse me. It's saying it's January 31st, 2020. I just may have to go into my settings and fits all of that but it's definitely not that okay yeah <laughs> but yeah i'll go into my settings and fix all of that up i just want to simply show you guys exactly how this is going to work all right so um chess let's see about charging um plugging up the fan real quick okay so really quickly um we're gonna plug into the fan into the one of the ac outputs and just see you know how it's gonna work out how much it's gonna actually pull it's already at five it was at one okay so your phone's charging pretty good all right plug that in real quick i'm just gonna turn on the fan here 
Oh, just kidding. I got to turn it on. All right, so we've got into the AC port here. Now I'm going to go to AC. It's, cur it's showing that it's currently off. Well, let me get focus. All right, it's showing that the AC... Okay, girl, I need you to stay focused. It's showing that the AC is currently off, so we're going to go ahead and turn that on. Touching our screen and hit on. Turn it on. Child, that fan blowing, honey. Feeling good in here, okay? I want to see exactly how many watts is actually going to be taking out of this port. Um, I'm going to give it a second to see if it's going to come up on the display here. Is it zero? It can't be zero watts. Is it zero? Yo, I think it's only zero. No way. I can run that fan all day. I mean, but the fan ain't nothing but so big. Oh my. Okay. I'm going to turn it down because I don't want it to be blowing too much. Okay, so as we all can see, um, the little fan, ain't bl it ain't blowing that much, child. It's not, you know, pulling too, ma too many watts. And the phone is only taking, at, right now, between 5 and 6. So that's not bad. Um, I'm going to charge some other products. I'm just going to try to load it up and see what happens. So, Chest, let's do my camera battery really quick. Okay, so being that the ports are kind of close together and some of my plugs are a little bit bigger, maybe let's put it at the bottom, Chad. Okay. Put it at the bottom here. Yeah. It's going to cover up, depending on what you're charging, it is going to cover up some of those AC outputs, so that would limit you from actually being able to use it. But that that's fine. I ain't got that many things to, you know, plug in. As you all can see that... Hold on, let me turn this fan off. Well, let me turn it this way. Okay. Okay, as you all can see, my battery charger is actually charging right now. Again, it's still showing zero watts. So, I, I guess, I mean, I would think you got to pull at least one of the watts, but I guess it's not. But yeah, it's still it's still seeing zero watts for that. Okay, guys, as you guys can see, your girl is down to 5%. But I did want to show you all that with it charging right here at the top, it's showing that it's pulling 40, 432 watts from the adapter. And then DC that's plugged up, that is currently my refrigerator that's actually Actually plugged up and that's taking 40 39 pulling 39 watts from it oh it keeps going up and up but um total on my refrigerator it shows that it's total it pulls 55 watts and as you all can see my refrigerator is on it's starting to cool off now this is my set power refrigerator as you guys know from previous videos but it's on i have it on eco so it's pulling now I'll try it with the jackery to see if it'll be able to charge this other uh charge station as well let's just see i got the jackery plugged up now this is at 36 percent okay so input y'all it's pulling 61 watts it's pulling 61 watts from my blue eddy look at this it's so crazy from here it's showing 131 121 wow this is a lot of power not only is it pulling 432 in to charge this baby look how much it's pulling out this is my refrigerator. This is the uh, Jackery power station. Child, shut your mouth and shoot me. I just had to jump in on the video and, and put this in the video because as I was showing you guys, it wasn't sure. It was showing zero watts, but this thing is built to um, charge larger appliances. So I said, well, let me, child, let me try something larger than it, okay? Um, so yeah, the, my Jackery power station, y'all, look at this. Pulling 121, 131. The fridge is now up to 55, 56. It's trying to cool down. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys. Okay, so now I just plug in my charger to my phone and to the USB port, and Chess is going to plug it in. Now, for this, you don't have to like touch anything on the screen because your DC ports and your AC ports are already currently on. So go ahead and plug it in, Chess. And let's just see how much it's pulling. Right, yeah, my phone like dead dead, so it's it's definitely pulling. Right now, it's pulling 16 watts. Yep, 16 watts. And then, yeah, that's wow, that's pretty dope. A couple of things about this Bluetti, really quick, I want to share with y'all. 
first off it is 60 pounds it's kind of heavy I'm not even gonna hold you it is 60 pounds so if you are looking for a power station where you're gonna have to move it a lot I just want you all to keep that in mind that this power station is 60 pounds it is very heavy duty let's just say that um, it is 15.2 inches wide the depth is 11 inches and also it is 16.5 inches tall it does run by a lithium battery and again it has a two-year warranty and look how many ports is on this thing like this thing is literally fully loaded yeah so so far this looks pretty good I'm gonna actually test it out for the next couple of days here while I'm out camping and we're just gonna see what it's gonna do and how it's gonna work out and as far as charging we're gonna pray about it child but I am currently in a van so I'll be charging it with the van and we'll see how much of a charge it will hold and give to me um, while you using this again um thank you blue eddie for sponsoring today's video um in the next clip you guys will see a review after a couple days after i have actually used it so i'll catch you guys in the next few days right, so really quickly i just want to give you guys a quick update on my blue eddie y'all this thing is literally everything it literally powered everything my entire time here on my trip and y'all i am in love like in love like i can't express how much i am in love with this thing it's literally everything look how much it's on look y'all the whole time been running a fan actually two fans i literally just turned that one off been running a fan uh my ring lights for you know my tiktok videos and stuff even got my cell phones plugged up my niece's cell phone plugged up and y'all i'm only at 46 percent the battery lasts a very very long time like a very long time right now um dc i'm pulling 13 watts and then ac i'm pulling 40 watts y'all this thing is amazing i'm like literally in love with this and i thought it was gonna be a little bit difficult to use because looking at all the different functions and all the touch screen i'm just like okay i don't know what i'm about to do but i'm about to try it okay and it honestly is not hard at all if anything you think um is wrong with your blue eddy what you can go to is go to your dad Data, click data show your fault history and it'll tell you if there's any issues or anything like that with your blue eddy um as you guys can sleep see i have no issues at all and no fault history at all so yeah that's pretty much that also on the bottom of this it's so heavy i'm sorry i can't show y'all but on the bottom of this there are like groups on the bottom so yeah that's that um don't forget this is 60 pounds so if you are looking to get in one of these be very mindful how often you're going to be using it in and out of wherever you're going or whatever just keep in mind it is 60 pounds but overall this is a really good power station i love it it literally charges everything that i need and more and y'all this is what i needed the whole time y'all hey guys i just wanted to give a big big thank you to blue eddie for sponsoring today's video y'all again i love it chess what you think about the power station I be honest be you honest you like the wireless charging we got a usb charge in the phone we do our little tick tock a little tick on the top <laughs> yes money what you think about the blue eddie think about it it's nice it's nice yeah any it, it lasts a lot longer than competitors i'm just gonna say that um but yeah it's it, a lot of plugs too yeah a lot of plugs which is good um and we can all plug up our phone at the same time don't have to run the van everything is good we are good so flashing charging everything flashing charge fan is running good i noticed like on this though on this fan the smaller one it pushes out a lot of power on this fan and it runs 10 times better when it's plugged up to this blue eddy versus my other power station so that's what i like most about it what do you like most about it chaz um what i like most about it is the touch screen on it you like the touch screen yeah that's definitely okay move what you like the most about it um how they have two um wireless chargers. oh the wireless chargers yeah mine like the wireless chargers on it but yeah, that's going to wrap things up for the video today, guys. Thank you all so much for stopping by and watching. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and always stay vibrant. Peace.